Good morning. On Airbnb's website, there's a section titled Domes. And well, it's basically a type of glamping. So we decided to try a couple of them, but they get progressively cooler as we go. My goal is to make sure my wife has the best time possible. And at the end, I'll be surprising her by taking her to one of the coolest places in America. This is where we'll be sleeping tonight. We're gonna test one review by a guy named Jack who said that the windows are dirty. They look clean in the, in the pictures. Right off the bat, they do look kind of dirty. And there are lots of bugs, which is great, which is exciting, yay. But yeah, it is. It is pretty dirty. I don't know how much you'll actually be able to see through it. Right off the bat, there were ants. Like, some bugs inside. Oh Said he just suspended in the air. What if it breaks in the middle of the night? Uh, is that a fat joke? Yeah. Oh, it like swings. Oh, this is so sick. <laughs> yeah, it is kind of dirty. That's okay. It's so cute. It's all good. Dang, this is so cool. Before making dinner, we decided to go to a nearby river walk. And it was really pretty and overall a ton of fun. We then ran to the store to grab a couple things and then tried our best to make a fire to heat up our food. Look at this art. Mmm. Look at that cheese. Oh my goodness. Yeah. True. Okay, while we're at Walmart, we got ah! we got this. The Mr. Beast Feastable Sampler Pack. First bar. Milk chocolate. Tastes like milk chocolate. It tastes like milk chocolate. It's good. What do you say? What is your favorite? Uh, the almond one. Almond? What would you give it out of 10? 20. Ooh. Because I don't 20. like chocolate. That's a good point, actually. She did like it. My favorite, I think the peanut butter one went hard. I didn't try that one yet. We just put everything in the, to the dome home, so I think we're going to go hop in there. Then we got rudely interrupted by this little fella. Kill it. <laughs> got it. Good morning. Okay, review. So... Like I said yesterday, the clear part wasn't super clear. We couldn't see like any stars or anything last night. The lights were cute though. The lights were definitely really cute. Added a good touch. Lots of bugs. Yeah, kept finding spiders and ants. Overall, six and a half out of 10. But this next dome home is gonna be really cool. And then also we're gonna go check out a cool view on the way there. See if I can do like a cool transition, like <sighs> cool transition. Okay, dome two, the one with the the funky door. Kind of was a whole journey to get here. We stopped at this really cute town. Went to a couple bookstores, got some cool things. I got a pair of shoes from this like garage sale. It's pretty lit. We stopped at some Dairy Queen inside of a lake. I made a friend and I named him Duckbert. Duckbert kept asking me for fries because he apparently was lost. Can I have some fries? After I gave him a couple, I found out that I wasn't supposed to, but eventually I had to say goodbye to Duckbert. And later when I saw a group of ducks, I thought about him and all the good times we had had. And the reviews from Bailey said this whole thing was a neat experience. The swing chair was pretty cool. The AC unit apparently doesn't work super well. We're gonna check the AC unit, even though it's kind of chilly. And then they have like an outdoor shower and a barn that we're gonna check out. Come with me. Here you have an amazing deck. Don't know what that is. What's the code? Wait. Oh, there it goes. So, right off the bat, cute fireplace, comfy chair. Yes, comfy chair. The swing chair. We'll be trying this later. Whole thing opens up. That is amazing. This is sweet. And we can see the stars. That's something that the review mentioned as well. Spoiler alert, we actually couldn't see any stars, but there was a tractor. My wife just went to the restroom real quick and I wanted to let you guys know, after our next Airbnb, we're gonna go to one of the coolest places in the United States. So she's always told me she want, she's wanted to go here. And it's actually the largest gas station in America. It's crazy. There's like 119 pumps. It's nuts. Make sure to watch the end so you can see her reaction. I just say, yeah, today was a great day. I'm glad we're finally here. We're just going to hang out. And I think we're going to eat dinner here in a little bit. We'll see what's on the menu. Um, the tortillas are wet. Don't ask. Don't, I'm not going to. Don't ask. And we're making popcorn. Woo! It's okay. This is normal. We eat popcorn for dinner all the time. <laughs> okay, so apparently you can't poke a hole in the popcorn. But it's okay because guess what? Look what we're eating. Sandwiches. And I got... Gummy worms. We have milk. <laughs> so we're eating good. After eating our sandwiches, we've just kind of been hanging out. And I'm super excited for tomorrow's dome. Like it's 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 gonna be pretty sick. We found ropes. I think I'm gonna do Taekwondo. Good morning. Today's gonna be a great day though. I'm super excited about something at this next dome. I think we're gonna go try the outdoor shower now. So that's gonna be lit. And see what we have for breakfast. We got some overnight oats. With some apples, maybe some Cheetos. Just kidding. Um, but not really. But not really. <laughs> Honestly, final review, I think I'd give it like a 9 out of 10. It was sweet. I'm going to do another cool transition. Boom. Cool transition. This is the last 
dome that we're gonna test. Kelly gave the review that you could hear every car, dump truck that drove by. She also said it was a mess when they got there. There was hair in the mattress. I really hope there isn't, because that's disgusting. There's also a river here. It's cold. It's gorgeous. It's so private and secluded. Okay, let's go. Let's test it. So we have like our own like patio thing down there. Let me go inside. Cool red door. <laughs> the bed is just in the middle of the room, which is fine. My, my wife may be making me sleep, but I don't behave. A toilet. That's pretty sick. This is cool. We can just see out the whole back window. Oh, there's already a single hair, but that is a hair. Kelly may have been onto something. I forgot to mention, we literally had to cross like this super sick bridge and take all our stuff in carts to actually get here. But before we turned in for the night, we ate some very yummy dinner. I don't care. tried seeing the stars. Apparently you can't see the stars in any of these. Super cringe. Well, I think we're going to bed now, so. <clears throat> Morning. You can hear every single car that drives past. Seriously, every single car. I know I said that you couldn't. It's so proud and secluded. I lied. There was the hair in the, the sheet, which is kind of gross. Other than that, the whole room is, is clean. And the whole like environment, all the stuff, like the little campfire down there where we had dinner last night, all of that. It's really nice. It's really nice. So overall, I'd give this dome an eight and a half out of 10. Oh, and I totally forgot to mention, the bugs here were kind of a pain. Overall, this experience has been super awesome. And it's been super cool to like get away and just be in nature. It'll be cool to like finish it off with where we're going today. I'm super excited. It's gonna be sweet. Where are we? We're at Bucky's, the world's largest Bucky's. I'm so excited! <laughs> This place was huge. We got some very fashionable merch, some really good food, and ended our trip with a 